coming over in about 10 minutes he might be here um and we're gonna put together the tv stand so what's left to build here i'll put you down we'll just put you in your stand what's left to build is the tv stand um the bed frame my nightstand and then um a little ikea unit um for my clothes so it's i probably did the ikea unit by itself it's one of those like four those square you know one square two square three square four square that's all that's left to build i think i have to unload the dishwasher but i'm gonna enjoy my coffee because it's going cold right now over there currently we gotta drink it you'll be here soon and we're gonna get back to work i have my midnight oh my gosh i don't know how i'm gonna do this we're gonna try. I have my all-nighter stream with Autumn Ashley, Brie Bonomo, and then Madeline Monaghan. We are all alliteration. That's so cool. Um, I have my midnight stream or my all-nighter stream with them. So Brie's hosting it at eight, I'm hosting it at midnight, and then Autumn's hosting it at four in the morning. I think we're going until six in the morning, which I don't know how that's gonna go. So, we don't see. I'll try to stay up for the entirety of it, but I don't know if we're going to be able to do that. But anyway, coffee. It's going cold. So. so, I don't look much different since when you last saw me, um, but it's significantly later. <laughs> um, it's been a day. It's currently 5.30. I'm going to make my second cup of the coffee of the coffee of coffee for the day because I have my midnight stream starting at 8. No, all night our stream starting at 8. Um, so, we have... I think I already explained it. But I do need a second cup of coffee because your girl is, look at those bags. She's been having it. She's been going through it, but we got internet today. So that's really exciting. And I think it'll be in tip top shape for the stream. I didn't test it. We should probably test it. This lighting, I'm never gonna get over it. You are crooked. I'm not exactly sure how. I know you're leaning, I see you, but like the, all the feet should be extended. I guess you're just gonna be leaning today. Perfect. So the plan is to actually sneakily unpack while I'm gonna go over here. The plan is to unpack while I am doing my streaming. As of this moment in time, I haven't announced that I'm moving yet. So I am already moved and I haven't even announced it. <laughs> I really don't know how I'm gonna fare tonight. I had to take a nap, it was a two hour, almost three hour nap. Maybe it's two and a half hours more. So I'm feeling good about it, honestly. Did I show you the TV in the stand yet? The TV is stupidly huge, but my TV in my room, we could not find the feed for it. And so instead of going without a TV until like we could find the feet or go out of the store and buy new feet, um, I borrowed the one from the basement. So it's ungodly huge. <laughs> But I wanted to disclaim that because I did not buy a brand new TV this large because it's, it's very large, but. Oh, and it's got like a plug for right there, if you can see. So it's, that's me. Hello. Oh, I've heard way too many horror stories or like seen like too many ghost stories like on the internet. People who like when you look up in a dark TV, there's somebody beside you, but there's nobody beside you in real life. So like, I can't look at dark TVs and we don't, I don't, I don't have the remote yet. So. We're gonna walk away, which is a good thing because the coffee's done. I don't know how to multitask while drinking coffee. This is me multitasking but not drinking my coffee. Because like, I don't have my TV, my laptop's upstairs. Do I just sit here and stare at the wall? I have to figure out where I'm putting all my DVDs. I'm thinking about buying a separate, hang on, the lighting's weird. I'm thinking about buying a separate, like, I should show you. Well, I'll put the picture back on the screen if I remember to. Um, the area next to the TV, there's a little bit of, there's a lot of bit of empty area. So obviously I don't want to make a mess in front of the walkway, but I think if I did it right next to the TV, I could buy like a little bookshelf-ish for a tea for a dvd stand there's just a lot of empty wall right there and i don't really know how to fill it my typewriter could go on one of those shelves because that's kind of cool it's a conversation starter not that 
people are coming into my apartment because I don't have friends, but <laughs> it's crazy to think that this isn't the amount of work that we've done in the past 30 hours. That's a lot of work that we did in less than 30 hours. And my calves are screaming because I went up and down those stairs yesterday. Like my camera cut me off from being traumatic. I don't know, maybe 20 times. I had a lot of boxes, you know? And I hear a few people like walking upstairs or something around me, which is very new for me because the house that I used to live in with my parents is detached like it's a single family home. So I wondered if like hearing people walk around would bother me, but it's so comforting to me to know like there are other people around me. It's so weird. And like I hear a dog, they, the neighbors have a dog. So they let it outside. I can hear it bark. And it's so comforting because it reminds me of my dogs, which I saw today and they were freaking out to see me and it made me want to cry. <laughs> I'm prefacing, not prefacing because this is already like how many minutes into this vlog. This was the lifestyle content that I was kind of talking about at the end of 2022. I was like hyping it up. I was, you know, mentioning it a lot. And I don't have a vlog, a writing update to give because I have not been writing. Obviously, writing has taken a back burner to all of this um once everything gets put together and my dad can you know i mean there's gonna say not be around but i want him around still once we get everything put together and like the rooms are set and stuff then obviously writing will come back which i think we'll be able to finish by like sometime tomorrow so like all we have left to build is the bed my nightstand and the mirror and then one of my closet organizers i think i already told you this writing wise i don't really have any updates to give besides the fact that my editor has gotten back with me um i got my manuscript back the 26th today is the 29th i looked at the edit letter but i didn't go through the inline comments and the edit letter was positive we we're going in a good direction and i think this next edit will be significantly easier than what the previous have been i think we got the story nailed down that's exciting i'm going to finish my coffee and oh it looks so pretty and i will check in with you guys when i go out to the office <laughs> which was the goal, but I didn't know if the room was big enough. It's big enough. I could put a desk here. A desk needs to go here, for sure. But I don't think I want it off the wall like it is right here. I think I want it against the wall. I'm not strong enough for this. To switch walls because I keep hitting that wall. I'm gonna put my desk here, I think, because I cannot, I cannot keep doing that, and I will. So it does look much better with the big desk by the window. This small desk here. This is where the tripods are gonna go. It just it feels so empty. So empty.
I show you the reveal? Let's look. Still empty. It's fine. But. Hung those with command strips. This one is off center. It's fine. Empty boxes. <laughs> cheeks are so red right now i'm warm <laughs> which it's weird because it's like 62 63 in here i've just been working a while back i pulled out my suit clay cases and i told you guys to guess what they were for and a lot of you guessed retreats and stuff and then some of you guessed moving which you are right but what exactly was i moving <laughs> Books. 